What happened to Theresa is still one of the most controversial cases in British legal history. Mother and daughter are together now, but for 12 years Bridget had no idea what was happening to her child. Yeah, I thought she was just hurt by the breakup of the marriage um, of myself and her father. I, I explained it away with, with things like that, you know, that this was because she, she'd come from a broken home. You see, Teresa's parents split up when she was just two years old and left her in the care of Nan, her grandmother. That's when her trouble started. Nan was part of a satanic cult. And we used to be taken to a house in the country, or one house in the country, where it would happen there. And it, we'd have ceremonies there, and we'd um, kill babies and adults and animals, and we were made to have sex with the animals. We were raped by my uncles and aunts and friends of the family. Now when you say we, you and other kids? My cousins, you know. Was Nan there? Was your grandmother there? Most of the time. You said that animals were killed there and people were, ki were killed there. Yeah. How did that happen? Um, to begin with, it was only animals. You know, I can remember them being brought in and cut down the middle and opened up. Um, it was usually in the stall on the table. We had a big table. Um, when the people were brought in, it was the same sort of thing. It was just, you know, a lot worse. As the rituals grew more violent, Teresa tried to escape, but the cult weren't about to let her go. 